here in the victorious Auckland locker room with guard Richie Incognito. Richie, you, you've been around the block in the league, been on a lot of teams. Does it feel like something special is brewing here? Because a lot of guys, when they come to London, it, it really builds the, the kind of team chemistry in the week. And obviously what happened with Vontaze last week, but that was a big statement tonight. Yeah, it was a statement win for us. You know, it's a, it's a long trip. We're far away from home. Uh, the team had a great week together, coming together, and uh, very resilient win. You know, we kept slugging with them. You know, it was we were up, we were down, we were up, and uh, it's a statement win for us. You know, it's a, it's a really good win. You know, we get to go home, take the long trip home, and uh, regroup. But it's been great. What do you think about what Coach Gruden and and Mike Mayock as well now are building here? Because you know, they ripped it up and started again a little bit last yeah. season. You, you're kind of in that process, but three and two, I think, is is better than what people expected going into the season. Yeah, you know, we are in uh, we're in the uh, the process of, of building a team and forming a team. You know, we got a lot of new guys, a lot of guys that have just gotten here, like like myself. But uh, it's wins like that that really make you come together, and it's wins like that 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 draw this team in tighter. And a couple weeks down the road, when we face adversity, we look back on London and be like, hey, we we're down to the best team in, or best uh, defense in the league, and we went at 97 yards and won the game. So. Uh, it's great. It's a feather in our cap, and uh, I'm really glad we got the win. It's the nicest part about that as well. You know, you had that great start, but it felt like everything that could go wrong had gone wrong yeah, yeah. early in the second half. So to, to, to get up, get back up off the mat like that, you know, there's not many teams who do that. No, it's tough. It, it's it's difficult, you know. Uh, um, resiliency, you know what I mean? Just, just, just some tough-minded people that work extremely hard, that are coming together, and we just kept swinging, and we, we came out on the top. And and forgive me ignorance, but you, you've played in London before, haven't you? I have. I've been here yeah, yeah, absolutely. Before, yeah. So, how does this compare to to Wembley, where I assume you played last time? Uh, you know, Wembley's great. Wembley has a ton of history, and it's a uh, it's a it's a great stadium. But this place is uh, second to none. Um, this locker room and the field setup has been great. Uh, I was really impressed by it. I mean, it's it's first class. Closely compares to what you see in the US. I mean, because this is, unlike Wembley, this is purpose built for NFL, as you mentioned, locker rooms. That we've seen the video of the field coming across as well. Yeah, it's been great. It's, uh, it's, uh, it was a great collaboration. You know, they really did a good job uh, nailing. You know, Wembley does feel like a soccer stadium. You know, the locker rooms are small. This feels like uh, an NFL locker room. You know, we're, we're all talking before the game that we hope uh, Vegas is as nice as this next year. <laughs> Thanks very much, man. Congrats.